What's going on everyone? This is Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales, and welcome back to IFK Gothenburg and Football Manager 2015. So, in this episode, we're going to do a quick recap and we're going to have a live com in this episode. So what we're going to do, we're going to crack on and we're going to go on to our schedule. And as you can see, it's been a bit of a shit um, time for our club at the moment. We are, well, we've lost three games in a row, one nil on each uh, occasion and each time I think it, let's have a look we had Joe Dudgeon sent off in the first game here against I think it's Jill Garden um, he got sent off and we were on the back foot all game basically all of our players played poorly we got bookings all over the place Tom Patterson got injured Christian Wilhelmsen got injured so it was a bad time for us and Joe Dudgeon had two yellows and he was off then in the second game we played IFK as it Nor Kippon or Nor Copping Nor Copping and again, you know, we had lots of yellow cards. Gustav Svensson, Tobias Eriksson, Sebastian Eriksson, Heath Pierce, Tom Petson again with the book in. And this time, Matthias, is it Biagemir or Biagemir? He got sent off with two yellow cards as well. Our goalkeeper had a 7.00 rate, and our best player, and that says it all basically. Absolutely disgusted with the way we've been playing. And then in this final game here, again, another sending off, Gustav Svensson with two yellows this time. Three games in a row, lost 3-1, uh, red card in all three games. Absolutely disgusting form. I'm, I've, I'm throwing the kitchen sink at, at my players in the training room at the moment. It's been absolutely terrible. So what we're going to do in this episode, hopefully, we've got a cup match now against Hammerby. It's the Svenska Kupen quarterfinal. And what I'm hoping for is a bit of a recovery and a good performance. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to press continue right now. Get that match going, guys. We're going to have a nice quick episode here. Get back into the swing of football manager. So, as you can see, Hammerby are actually a Division 1 team. They play in the Super Retana. Or su yeah, Super Retana, Ret Retana, I think it is. Um, so, we should be better than them as far as divisions go. So, let's do match preview. Team selection. Now, i got decisions to make here. I'm not happy with the way my team's playing. I need to think of something... Um, quite you know soon so as you know Tobias Eriksson was sent off in one of those games I think Billy Nordstrom my youngster who looks pretty decent as far as his stats go not quite sort of you know a starter in the first team but he's got a chance to, to do something in this team and perhaps improve and maybe in a year or two's time he'll be a top midfielder at this level so I'm going to bring him in for this cup match uh, I'm going to I'm going to have faith with Joe Dudgeon even though I'm, I'm upset that he got sent off in that uh, game that I just showed you there um Wilhelmsen, Reeks, Soren Reeks, and Lasse Vibe are going to be my front three for this game, I think. Uh, just looking through my team right now. Aristide Banche could perhaps start for me up front. Yeah, no, I'm going to go for it in the cup game. He's back from his injury. So we're going to go with that team. and I'm, I'm pretty happy. It's pretty strong. One or two changes here and there. Let's do it, guys. Let's go for it. So submit team, proceed. I'm going to go with the formation, and if this doesn't work, I'm going to have to change my formation, I think, because this just isn't good enough right now. We must come back with a good performance. We must improve. It is it is vital. It is definitely vital. So we've got the advice on. Okay, I'm going to tell my team very passionately, show me what you can do. Come on, you can do it. I'm going to tell my midfielders very calmly, uh, get control of the midfield out there, and let's start the match. Here we go, guys. Kick off time and let's see the first highlight. This oh, here we go, right? Johansson and Banche's got the ball. The big blonde here, green boots, nice green boots. Oh, I lost the ball. What are you doing? Silver halt. Don't like this. Kennedy. It's Railson back to Hagland. Oh, shit. Rodri. Oh, it's gone wide. Whew. <laughs> Got away with that one. Got away with it. Okay, so... Let's have a look at the stats. Two shots to one. Hmm. Nordstrom with the free kick. Not a... Not a... Well, it's a terrible ball. Johansson to Eriksson. Ball back to Svensson. Oh, couldn't find... Wilhelmsen. Why couldn't you find him? Israelson, Kennedy, across to Silverholt on the left wing for Hammerby. Good tackle, Johansson. Get in there, boy. 
Wilhelmsen. Oh, a bit lag there. Wilhelmsen gets the ball in. Banche. Oh, he missed it. Come on. Ricks. Ah, oh, the post. Why? Ah, oh, shit. Nordstrom. That's a shit corner. That's fucking terrible. Come on now. That was a terrible corner. Just lopped it up in the air like a fucking madman. What's he thinking? Waiting for the next highlight. Come on. Frederick Torstein Bo is offside and half time nil nil. Okay. We are at home. We should be doing a lot better than this. We're against a team in the division below us. I'm not happy with this. Uh, this advising me to encourage them. Hmm. I'm going to turn the group and grab that one goal for us. Oh, two of them switched off for fuck's sake. Okay, I'm going to be quite assertive because I'm unhappy. You can make a difference. Okay, that's better. They look happy. I'm going to tell the midfield the same. Um, you can make a difference. I know you can. Oh, the delighted and the striker. I'm going to calmly tell him. And Okay, nothing happened there. But we got a few of them happy at half time. That's good. Team talk has sunk in now. The players are there. They're focused. They're trying to think about what they're going to do. For this team. To get his team back up and running this season. And Gustav Svensson's picked up a knock. And we have to substitute him in about 10 minutes. Wait till the 60th minute mark. Uh, mark and then we'll make a decision then. I think he can, he'll be okay for now. Nordstrom. This is Johansson at right back. Forward to Nordstrom. Short pass to Sebastian Eriksson. To Jonsson. Ericsson. Reeks. Soren Reeks. Aristide Banche. Nordstrom! Ah, bastard. Person. Oh, he's bastard. Okay, 50th minute. We, we're going to have a bit of time with this. Uh, well, we're not going to make any changes just yet. We're going to wait a little bit longer. Soren Reeks. Passes, man. Good ball through Wilhelmsen. Yes! Come on! Whew. Christian Wilhelmsen. It doesn't sound myself. Fucking hell. It's like 34, isn't he? I don't care. We are in, in the lead. We are in the lead. Christian Wilhelmsson. The former Sweden international with a fantastic finish. What a finish. All right. This is good. Gustav Svensson. Oh, his fitness is going up slightly as well. That's good. Although 6.5 is a bit of a concern. We may have to take him off. I think we will take him off, actually. Let's uh, pause that. 68%. 6.5. Uh, Tobias Eriksson can come on for him in our defensive role I'm just going to do that I'm going to give Tobias uh, a calm I have faith in you go out there and make a difference felt the manager lack credibility you prick who do you think you are Dude, they're abusing me these players and Gustav Svensson is actually injured now as well so that's unfortunate hope it's not a bad injury and Hammerby have a free kick with Kennedy oh keeper fucking hell what's that what the fuck? What the fuck was that? Why did the keeper make a save there? Why could he pick that up? And how the fuck did he get in from that angle with three players by him? That is... That is abusive. How the fuck did... I'm not happy. I am not happy. Joe Dudgeon's injured. Fuck sake. I can't. I can't believe it. That is just disgusting. Okay, I'm gonna get Heath Pierce on for Joe Dudgeon at left back. I'm also gonna bring on uh, Lasse Vibe for Alistair Banche at the top, and let's go with that. And now we're going to tell them to overload. Uh, by opposite, wrong one. Got five minutes left. We're at home. Come on, we we gotta get a goal, surely. Surely we gotta get a goal. Oh. Four minutes added. Come on. Ooh, got a chance. Nordstrom to Pettersson. Good ball in. Vibe. Oh, he missed it. Oh, he missed. Shit, it's going to be one all. I can see it happening. Got extra time. Fuck's sake. 
All because of a stupid goalkeeping error. Right. Um, aggressive. I'm going to have to be aggressive. Not happy with you out there. Oh, bad team to fire you up. For fuck's sake. Right. We have to change our formation. Um, no, we'll, keep, we'll stay in, in this current formation, I think. Um, although, can we like, swap? I'm just trying to see who... No, I think we'll go with Ericsson. We'll bring Sebastian deeper and Tobias further forward, I think. And... Just make a slight change in the midfield. We can't make any subs now. Brought all three substitutes on. Of course, you know, two for the injured players and then one for Lasse Vibe to come on. But boy, oh boy, that was that was hard to take. That bloody this, the match engine see in this game is is stupid. It's, it's, they make stupid things like that happen, which is really annoying. Oh, I hope we don't lose this now. Johansson with a throw. Wilhelmsen. Back to Johansson. Gets the ball in. Oh, it's gone over everyone. Reeks can keep it alive. Soren Reeks to Sebastian Eriksson. Turns. Finds Tobias Eriksson with a good ball in. Comes back out to Johansson with the cross. Oh, God. It's gone. It's been cleared. Pettersson. Johansson. Nordstrom. To Jonsson. What the... Why are you kicking it back there, for fuck's sake? Oh, this match engine is pathetic. Come on now, kick it out, for fuck's sake. Thank you. Listened. Vibe. Vibe with a shot. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, Vibe. Vibe. Yes. <laughs> what a freaky goal. <laughs> oh, well, that was another goalkeeping error right there. Look at that shot. Keep, uh, it bounced off his foot. And again it bounced off his foot. And then he followed up and... Well, we've seen two incredible goalkeeper errors now in this match. One for me, one for them. Actually, I need to be concentrating by here. Right, uh, defensive. Let's check into the defensive. Asymmetrical. And play it. I'll play it until we can pause it again. Pause it, check my tactics, just check I'm doing things. This is my... Um, oh, actually no, I want to go there and then we'll pull the two of them back to a flat midfield with the uh, outdoor oh, mentality. We want to play counter so we can burst forward if we have to. That's what I wanted. Okay, we'll play. Let's play ball. Okay, it could be over. It could be over. Come on now, come on. Yes, we've done it. Fuck yeah. 2-1. Get in. So... I can be proud. I'm not proud of the fucking team. That was okay. That was good. I just say good win to keep them all happy, but that was pathetic. Uh, I mean, look at this. Um, well, we had 13 shots to the 10. Too many for them, as far as I'm concerned. There's too many shots to the away team. We had seven on target. They had three on target. We had 26 fouls we've given away. That's just that's our problem. We're just giving away too many free kicks. But we're through to the semi-final. Of the Svenska Kuppen. And I don't know who we're going to be against next. Um, uh, I just have to check all this crap out. Through to the quarterfinal. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, I've said the assistant. I don't, I don't feel like talking to anybody. And I, I think I'll... That'll be it for this episode. So I've been Dragonheart. The very angry but also pleased Prince of Wales. Until next time. Goodbye.